There's quite a few other things that we also have to keep an eye on, including uh, overnight here over in New Zealand, we're expected to get a rate decision out of the Reserve Bank there. Yeah, the New Zealand Central Bank, they were the first one to target 2% inflation. Yeah, I mean, blame they, them. they're the, yeah, yeah blame, blame New Zealand, <laughs> not Canada. Uh, but <laughs> Bank of Canada also coming out with its rate decision, so blame them both. That's all. And then, of course, we're going to go over to Asia mm -hmm. because South Korea... We have some elections going yeah, on. So yeah, so some critical elections. We'll be monitoring all that along with uh, the trade in the one and the Korean Kospi, and we'll keep you posted on the, all those developments there. Yeah, so this is actually a big international focus, and you wonder how this is going to uh, bleed into the U.S. markets. We were talking about this a little bit earlier, uh, the Japanese Prime Minister and President Biden meeting mm -hmm. at the White House tomorrow. Yeah, and they're going to stress uh, all the economic cooperation that there is that exists between the two countries. One thing that they may not bring up that's kind of going to hang over them that? is what happens with Nippon Steel. Yeah. Right. And it's bid for U.S. Yeah. deal. And well, they'll Biden talk has, about it. Well, they won't. It won't be yeah. part of the readout. Yeah, necessarily. but they're not. Yeah, they're just not going to tell us. <laughs> tell us what, what they said here. But that's a good point, and it gets to this whole idea of how do you sort of create an allyship there or strengthen that allyship at a time where you're still kind of doing protectionist policies. Yeah. yeah. All right, and then that uh, brings us back to Washington here. Uh, uh, I thought Congress had other things to do, but apparently they're actually going to move forward with this impeachment process uh, for Mayorkas. You know what? Maybe this is yeah. something that they can get done over the course of two weeks because they're only back in office weeks. for two weeks before yeah. they're off again uh, for recess. So as not Joe Ukraine, told us. not budget deals. Not That's TikTok. too complicated. Okay, not too complicated. And, of course, we bring you back to the markets here. And, of course, in addition to the CPI data in the morning, we get those FOMC minutes at 2 p.m. Eastern time.